We have to go potty. I had this brilliant idea where we'd start to at least try to take him out in the car twice a week, once a week, uh, for um, errands or whatever. And so now they don't think that they should ever have to do any work. I don't know what last night was there. Whew. All right, so got a hat, another hat. This is a cute one. These aren't very expensive at all. So what I'm getting ready to do is, um, really, I shouldn't even discuss it. I had started that uh, delivery thing with my husband. I really enjoy it, actually. Um, if if we get a lucky day, um, I guess it's about, I know the other day it was about two hours or so. So we got about 70 bucks uh, doing deliveries. Maybe if I just keep it vague, don't say the company. Uh, last week, some weird stuff. Um, definitely with one delivery was odd. Something like weirdly set up. And then uh, this one store experience and the dog food store. So... Not sure what kind of angle is being, um, I, who knows. This is what I do know as I still keep getting, but then again, I think I've been getting the same type of message. Uh, not much longer, hold in there, hang in there. Really not much longer, we're at the, we're, we're at the home stretch. But I don't know if that means like God fixing stuff. So what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna just get the puppies stuff ready. So I woke up at five. We can uh, start deliveries around 6.30. And I'm the one, I always say I hop out of the car. No. And I figured out this well thing. It wasn't, the, it's not the well. It was something with the Freemason jars. Apparently a bunch of people had trouble. Something was changed with the lid. And they get all messed up. So I did, what I do is I just make sure that they went out. I get a little bit fixed up. And it's fun to do the deliveries with my husband. Well, it's funny because when I was discussing it a lot last summer, that's when he got creamed off the, the road into a ditch, almost into a telephone pole. We still have the bumper tied up. We could have already bought the bumper, but we didn't. I have a little upset all the other night is... Uh, this guy, it was, we went to the store the first time, and it was just all of a sudden, yeah, they don't mess around, they greet intensely, well, they're like me, mostly, it's probably why it's difficult, it's like three firecrackers hanging out all day together, unless we're just sitting on the couch, or resting, So I had wanted to revisit about the Luke, chapter of Luke. That was shortly before they hauled uh, Jesus off. <clears throat> and uh, it's very important to read through that. I learned something. It was a continuation of something that was in Matthew. Hi. And... Uh, They're already getting stressed because they don't know where I'm going. That's me because they lost the two elder dogs within a year or something close. Yeah. Yes. And then also my son left. I uh, never really, really heard of again much and a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of stuff went down at the other property. <clears throat> so there seemed like it was a good reason for me to come on here. My dreams have gotten a little odd. I don't even trust most of them anymore. Um, and get my hat on. Uh, there has been a decent amount of dreams, though, where I don't put any, 
I don't put any, it was something I used to do when I was younger a bit, but I don't anymore only because of the harassments that are going on with people, meaning, um, visual auditory harassments in some instances. Well, I was getting a series of dreams the last few weeks of, um, like in a general format, people getting false charges more, um, uh, being hauled in. And I don't know if that's what Jesus, if I'm getting that clearly from Jesus is, uh, they being hauled the, um, not much more time. Meaning, is it final judgment soon? Or when a bunch of us are hauled off, off under false charges. Or charges that are... You see, I'm pushing the limit because I do say things that are... Mm, you could... It wouldn't be too much to to accuse me. Plus with what, what the rap sheet looks like. And so... <laughs> I just wanted to say I love you. Um, I would love to say I know exactly what not much longer means. Uh, that's a different, it's a different way that I was getting it before. Before it seemed like it was always supposed to be, like I said, five, ten years, twenty years. Um, but I don't know if it just means there's like going to be a shift. And, um, and to be ready. <laughs> it's like, oh, well, this is really helpful. No, it's not. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go. And, um, I might try to fine tune what I feel like I need to express later today or another day. Part of me is wanting to try to, to lay low, but I, I just simply can't no more. So I don't know what went on in here. Last. God, I said I was having some weird dreams. It looks like I was throwing covers in the air. All right. So I gotta go. See ya.